Hey gamers, Stogie here, and welcome to a new episode of The Sniper School. In today's episode, we will be talking about PC versus console controls. As you can see right now, I'm on PC and I'm on the practice range. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys my settings here because this is very important. Here you can see my mouse settings and my sensitivity. I'm at about 1800 DPI right now. I've also reduced my field of view down to 60 because 60 is what consoles are at. So we're looking at apples to apples today. I normally play at about 100 field of view, about 110 field of view on PC, but wanted to make sure we were comparing apples to apples. Right now what you can see I'm doing is um, a practice technique of popping headshots. So pay close attention how I'm able to zoom in on these targets and snap to that head. Watch how quickly I'm able to do it on PC with the mouse. That's because on with the mouse and keyboard, you're actually able to just traverse a certain distance and land right on your target. Now we're gonna look at some console footage. So I'm gonna try to repeat exactly what I did. You're gonna hear see my sensitivity at 36%. I'm also using an FPS freak on my right thumbstick. I highly recommend them. What those do is gives your gives your thumb a larger range of motion so you can play at a higher sensitivity. But look at the difference. So it's a more methodical pace to get to that headshot, and it's a little bit more challenging. So you will see this throughout some PC and console gameplay I'm gonna show you here in a second. One thing I want you to notice is how I kind of pop at the same speed towards that head and then finally land on the head and have to stop. That's because not like with the mouse where you have to traverse from a certain spot on your mouse pad to another spot, the joystick, you're not able to actually move anywhere. You actually are all based on acceleration. So what you can see I'm doing right now is moving both thumbsticks. So I'm moving my feet and I'm moving my head at the same time. This is a big deal for me when sniping on console. I really need to not stay stationary with my feet versus on PC I can go ahead and pop those headshots pretty easily without moving my feet. like to do the two different things so let's put this into practice and show it in some gameplay. Right now what you're seeing is PC gameplay and I want you to again take notice of how quickly I'm able to snap to my point and hit those headshots. Uh, number one thing of sniping in Battlefield 4 is hitting those headshots. There's the defensive perk upgrade and that eliminates that one hit kill to the chest for a lot of these weapons. And some of these sniper rifles don't even have one hit kills to the chest because of their damage model. So general rule of thumb when sniping is you're going to want to aim for the head. So what you're going to see here is you're going to be able to see, and, and here's a great example of it. This guy's going to pick up the bomb and watch how quickly I'm able to snap to his head. And again, the reason I'm able to do that is because I have my settings and my mouse sensitivity down, so I know exactly how far to move my hand on the mouse pad, exactly how far. I really recommend you guys hop in the practice range and get those sensitivity settings just right for you, so you're used to scoping in and kind of moving from point A to point B and getting that accuracy down. That's what's gonna make you a good sniper in Battlefield 4 on PC. Again, the difference is, when I'm talking about console sniping versus PC sniping, and, and let me stress this, one is easier than the other. It is definitely easier to hit and land headshots on PC than it is on PS4. 100% certain. I mean, I've played lots of hours on both, and I can tell you with 100% certainty it's easier to hit headshots on PC than it is on console. But let me also make it very clear, that is not to say it's easier to be a sniper on PC. That may not make a whole lot of sense to you, and here we just flashed on over to some console footage, so pay attention to the to the difference in how I lag and how I drag into those headshots at a lot slower rate. And again, the reason I have to drag into those headshots at a slower rate is because my joystick is positioned in a certain spot on my controller. I cannot move that. I can angle it left and right, and that changes the acceleration with the way my guy looks left and right, but to end that acceleration and land on the head, I have to bring the joystick back to the center position. So unlike PC where I can make one movement, with console sniping to go from the head, from where you're at to the head, you have to make two motions. You have to go in the direction you're gonna go and then you have to bring it back to stop it. So it is a lot more challenging. But again, back to what I was saying, does not make it more difficult to be a sniper on PS4. And why is that? It's because the guys you're playing against are doing exactly the same thing you are. So on PC, it may be easier to get those headshots lined up, but you know what? The guys that are firing at you, they're getting the same benefits that you are. Same thing on console. It may be harder to line up those headshots, but the guys that you're shooting against, they're having just as hard a time as you. It's not like a mouse and keyboard player is playing against a controller player. That's a very important thing to note here when talking about the differences. And that is my main point with today's video for you guys to understand that. And there's a pretty sick shot. So let's head back to the range. I want to show you 
apples to apples again here this is console footage right now so I'm what I'm gonna do is flip these barrels and watch how I'm able to trace motion see how jerky that looks and I practiced this a couple times but that's the difference with console sniping versus PC the way you're able to follow your target it's a lot jerkier and this is again what what makes it harder to get that better accuracy on console now let's switch on over to PC here and watch me shoot again watch me follow on PC so I'm gonna hit this button and, and these barrels are gonna come up. Look how smooth this is. Look at the difference. That is superb control. So again, that's why I say sniping, accuracy, everything is going to be easier and better on PC, but it does not mean that it is actually easier, better relatively. You need to understand that the people you're playing against have the same advantages or disadvantages that you do. So that's the main thing to take away from today's video. If you understand the relationship of what you're doing with your hands and how that relates to what you need to do on screen, I think that's very important. I think it's also very important for people that are on the different consoles to know what they're up against. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It's just a very brief interaction into PC versus console because again, in a lot of my videos, we're gonna be talking about how it affects PC, how it affects console. So as we get into the nitty gritty details of different techniques and different weapons and things that you can do, I want you guys to keep the perspective of what I'm talking about, PC and console. So thanks for watching guys. Huge amount of support on the introduction video. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys continue to tune into this series, and I will talk to you guys later.